Hello everyone, I hope you are all doing well. From today until probably the next 3 weeks, I want to test the direct cooking of food in the focal point of the system. Because after that we may start steam pressure tests and in this case we won't be able to do these things. Well, today I will start by preparing popcorn. Look, I bought this popcorn that tastes like pizza cheese, and it is very delicious, and nowadays they produce popcorn with different flavors. Of course, I don't think any of them are healthier than plain popcorn. Now I want to make a tank in the focal point of the fixed focus system, which can be used to make both roasted corn seeds and roasted seeds. Now we will do this together to see if it is possible and to get the experience of this work, and this is the first time I want to make popcorn. Let's go to get started. First, I have chosen a 12 volt DC 5 watt electric motor. This electric motor has a gearbox and its engine speed is 10 revolutions per minute. And I have prepared the place of its screws and will install it. You can see that this electric motor was installed like this. And its direction is in line with the whole of the second column. Its power supply cord contains an on and off switch. And it is directly connected to a 10 watt solar panel. I have used a ribbed cylindrical tin can to make a special chamber for heating seeds. We put the lid on it like this. And by cutting, I have created this small door in the middle, and we can easily insert corn seeds through this door. I have drilled holes on both sides of this cylindrical tank, and since the threaded screw longer than 1 meter was not available, I used two 1 meter ones. One end of these screws is connected to the output axis of the electric motor, and the other end is passed through the tin can. And I connect them both with a long nut in this way. Now it is ready to install on the system. Now if I start the motor, you can see that it is turning slowly. This 10 watt solar panel can easily supply the energy needed for our electric motor. Well, I have prepared a quantity of corn kernels, which I have poured cooking oil on them, and I will mix them and put them in a tin cylinder. 
Of course, I think this amount is enough. Care should be taken so that the tank is not hot. Now I turn on the electric motor and adjust the focal point of the solar dish. Now the focal heat is on the cylinder. It has not been long before the sound of corn kernels is heard. Now two minutes have passed and the cooking oil has been removed from our solar boiler and the sound of the corn kernels being expanded can be heard. This smoke is related to burning oil. Now five minutes have passed and I think it is enough. First, I turn off the electric motor in a position where the outlet door is below and remove the tin tank from the focal point. Now I open the door. The result was this popcorn, some of which is burnt and is not acceptable. The reason why the popcorns are burnt is because the rotation speed of the electric motor is low, so I need to change the electric motor to increase the rotation speed. You can see that I changed the electric motor and its output is 70 RPM. This motor is very small and has 3 watts, and although the tin cylinder does not move in the same direction, it is better for our work and seeds move corn better. This time I will use more corn and of course without oil and let's see what will happen. I turn on the electric motor and place the focal point on the tin tank. The sound of corn kernels cracking is easily heard. It should be noted that the solar dish does not necessarily have to be large for this purpose, and this work is possible with a small dish. Almost 5 minutes have passed and there is no more sound of cracking the corn kernels in the tank. I removed the tank from the focal point and I have to put the tank in a position where the small lid is facing down. This time we succeeded and it is very interesting. Look at the popcorn, it's so crispy and delicious. There is no burn in it. Not even one grain of popcorn is burnt, even a single one. It's really interesting and you can see that not even a single one is burnt and they are all white and flawless. And it is very crispy and very interesting. Now, let's see if we can make roasted seeds and if it is possible or not. Let's continue the work with sunflower seeds. 
I prepared some sunflower seeds, which of course are not good quality seeds and now we pour it in a tin cylinder. Now I turn on the motor and adjust the solar dish. This time, there is no sound like corn kernels, and it is not clear whether the sunflower kernels are cooked or not. Of course, I have no experience in this matter and this is the first time I am doing this in front of you. In my opinion, it is enough, and now 6 minutes have passed, and maybe it has burned. Again, I remove the tank from the focal point and take out the sunflower seeds. It is hot but not well cooked. Of course, it is almost cooked, but it needed more time to get better, and I think 10 minutes would have been better. The plate is too hot, I will leave it here. Now suppose this system is next to the seashore and the system does not need to be this big. How interesting it would be to make a perfect popcorn without needing any fuel and present it to the customer. In the future program, I want to make a roasted chicken with a fixed focus system and see if it will be possible. I hope this video was a good experience for you. Until the next program, take care of yourself and goodbye. Most videos on Fixed Focus channel have their own innovation and you won't regret watching them, thank you for subscribing and liking.